and dig your sole of your feet. Rough and dig your sole of your feet. And he said, one day you find gold. <laughs> I dig for so 30, 40 years, I never find gold yet. <laughs> but I think that I don't get sick for a long while. So maybe those money that you pay to the doctor, you can buy a lot of gold. <laughs> okay, so rub your leg warm. I know you're wondering, uh, people, you know, sometimes they don't take care of their, so their feet. Because when we take it out and it smells, you know, and you don't want to, hmm, smell, and you don't want to even touch it, you know. And one day you cannot walk. And you say, oh my God, my feet, you know. And sometimes it's too late, you know. <laughs> so you rub it and hit it, you know. Thirty-six times, it's good. You can hit more if you want. <laughs> and rub it warm. Now, you started to feel your soul, and when you, when you put your feet down, you started to aware of it more. Because this is, this one we call kidney one, okay? It's connecting direct to the kidney. We call the bubble spring. It's also connecting right into the earth, okay? So it's very directly connecting with the kidney very connected with the kidney. So that's why this point is very important in the Tao practice for everything. So the Tao practice, they decide a lot of sitting, standing, or moving. Okay? And always so much concerned with about this bubble spring. You have one, two, three point. One, two, three. Okay? So this, all this is very important. So rub it warm and keep on digging the hole. <laughs> digging the bubble spring hole. And one day when you find gold, you can tell me. <laughs> you rub them and work on all these things a long time, five years, ten years, haven't seen doctor for a while, and you have more energy to work and more creating power. I don't know how many gold you're going to make. <laughs> and hit them 36 times. You can hit more now. I believe that you hit the soul every day can cure any disease. That means you maybe have to hit a thousand times a day. <laughs> hit if you're sick, you have nothing to do, hit them every day. <laughs> Rather than sitting there on the bed and looking on the ceiling, you know. <laughs> At least you have something to do, huh? <laughs> so we want to, uh, we want to, um, Doing the soul, very important, the soul of the feet and connecting with the kidney. So we're going to start it to work on the kidney area, okay? Work on the kidney area. Because the kidney area is so much involved with the, um, uh, storing the energy and storing the power. So um, the second, the second, the earth. Nine planets, earth affecting us the most. That's all. If you don't in touch with the earth, I don't know what else you want to in touch with. <laughs> um, the earth energy will rise up and charge your, your, your kidney. So let feel your feet. You put your hand on the knee. 
So when you sit in this position, you have a very, connect, very close connection to the earth. Earth, okay. So you feel your knee warm, and you feel the energy go down to the earth. So you cover your knee, and you smile to your soul, your feet. You put your attention, the power of intention. When you aware your soul, and you smile to the soul, you make connection. That's all. You make connection. Start to feel the sensational in your soul of the feet. And start to feel you can breathe in. Inhale, exhale to your soul. And start to feel the soul are breathing. And smiling down, deeper, deeper down to the earth. When you relax enough and your soul of your feet open, you feel the frequency. The 7.8 up, 7.8 to 8 frequency. A very light vibration and light electricity, light electricity. If you have very high voltage of electricity running from the ground up to your soul, your feet. And run up to your bones, the leg bones. Thou believe the earth energy can increasing and build up your bone marrow. Continue, continue come up to your sacrum. Smile to your sacrum and see the eight holes of the sacrum. Have nose and mouth and breathing. Inhale, power, power of intention, breath. Power of intention, breath. Inhale, soul and the sacrum are breathing. Now, feel a really, really feel when you relax, smiling, relax, relax. Keep on inhale, exhale, relax down to the ground. And you, the more you surrender, in the religious they say, the more you surrender. In the Tao, some say, the more you relax down to the ground. When you relax, 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 and suddenly you feel energy rises up to you. You don't have to do anything because the energy is there. That's all. It's there. So relax, inhale, exhale, relax, down to your soul. Again, inhale, exhale, down to your second and your soul, your feet. Relax, relax, let's go. The more you exhale and relax, and you suddenly you feel the Mother Earth energy rise up to you. And without any struggle, without anything, doing anything at all, you feel the energy. And rub your hand warm. And cover your kidney. Behind, above, and under the rib cage a little bit. On the back. Cover your kidney. But you're going to emphasize your soul breathing. The more you can feel your soul breathing, 
And suddenly, when you are a little bit aware of your kidney, you also feel your kidney are breathing. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale to your soul and the kidney. Now feel the earth energy charge into your kidney. Like wrapping, 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 wrapping into your kidney. You're feeling nice and warm. Feel your kidney nice and warm and feel energetic. Now put your hand back so you don't feel too tight. Holding your knee and feel the earth energy started to continue up and wrap around your kidney very slow. Very relaxed. So and second breathing. Feel your kidney being wrapping around with energy. Charge with energy. Right, just sit back very relaxed. Feel your kidney. Smile to your kidney. And feel you have a protecting chi. Wei chi, a protecting chi. You're breathing, you feel a uh, protecting. And when you practice to one level, you can really feel that the, the airborne virus, bacteria, They, when they come to in touch with your aura, they bow back. They've been pushed back. They otherwise they flow in the air and go into your nose and go into your mouth. And the fire space, when people don't take care of their body very well, when the bacteria and germ come in, they say, oh my God, this is my heaven. No, I'm never going to leave this body. So they build an empire inside you. And finally, the empire strike back, you know. Get trouble. Don't worry if your mind wandering around. Get back again. Try to feel nice and warm. And remember that next time you call them back, it's very fast and very soon it happen. Rest. 